Hello guys and welcome back to Lead Logics. This is the largest three same digit number in a string problem. It is a lead code easy and the number for this is 2264. So in this problem we are given with a string num representing a large integer and an integer is good if it meets the following condition. So the condition for uh, integer to be good is that it should be a substring of the string num. So the input string num should have a substring that is of length 3. So this is condition 1. And the second condition is that it should consist of only one unique digits. That means all the digits of the substring should be same. Like the substring uh, should be 111, 222, 333, 444, like this and so on. So it should be like this only. So we have to return the maximum good integer as a string or an empty string if no such integer exists. So if there are multiple good integers, we have to return the maximum good integer. Otherwise, we have to return an empty string. So, okay. So, as you know, substring is a contiguous sequence of characters. This is, and leading zeros may also be there in the good integer. So, okay. So, we have an, an example one. So, in this, we have 777, which is an example of a good integer, and then 333, which is an example of a good integer. But we'll choose 777 because there it is written the maximum good integer as a string. Now let's see how we are going to do. Uh, it is a sort of dry run of the approach. So we are going to take the length of three substrings at a time and check if uh, it has the unique digit or not. So we'll, this is the input. So in the first iteration, the first three elements will be 677. So 677, all the digits are unique, no because there is a 6 and a 7, so 2 unique digits. Now, the window, uh, window size, uh, like window size remain the same and it shifts forward. So the 6 exits and a new 7 enters. So the current substring becomes 777. Is it all the digits are unique? Yes. So the number becomes 7 and the result is 7. Similarly, we'll be iterating over the entire string. So it will become 771. Then we have no 713, all the digits unique, no 130, all the digits unique, no. Then we have 333. So for 333, we have all the unique digits. Yes. So the unique digit is 3. But since we have a larger number in our result, we will not store 3 in this. And uh, 333 again, but uh, still we are having 7 as a larger integer, so we will not take 3. And at the end, we will uh, multiply the result like if we have a result uh, 7 so we'll replicate it to to be 777 and return it as the answer otherwise we'll return an empty string so let's start with the code section but before that do like the video share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel if you are new to the channel so our goal was to find the maximum good integer so we'll be going to iterate over the string num but before that, we need to define a int result that will store the result. And initially, it will be minus 1 because at the end, if it is minus 1, we can return an empty string. So we have to iterate over the string. And what we'll do? Since we are taking three elements at a time, so we'll do i plus 2 less than num dot length we can also do num dot length minus uh, 2 <clears throat> it is as per your choice and in this what we will do if num dot char at i equal equal num dot char at i plus 1 and then in this basically we are checking if all the digits are unique or not so if it is unique we'll store it in the result but we have to check that it should be larger than our result only so result comma num dot care at i 
and since we have to convert it into an integer so we are going to subtract a zero in the character form so this becomes a number and uh, since we have to return it by replicating it so I'll use a string builder here since we have to do it three times so I loop goes on till three times builder dot append you should mean cat If result equal to minus one, then we are going to return an empty string. Otherwise, we are going to return builder, but we have to convert it into a string. So, okay, this is done. Let's try to submit it for the sample test case. The sample test cases are passed. Let's try to run for the hidden test cases as well. So hidden test cases also pass a good time complexity and a good memory complexity as well so the time complexity for this solution is o of n because we are iterating for the each character in the string and space complexity is o of 1 since we are not using any extra space uh, you can also check my c++ java and python codes by going into the solution panel this is my solution you can go here see the explanation approach as well java python javascript c++ and also you can upvote so this was the video for uh, largest three same digit number in a string i hope you understood the logic please like the video share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel thank you for watching have a nice day